We're in Portland and I'm about to take you somewhere very special. Can you tell when I'm standing in front of, oh my gosh, it's the Portland Leather Goods outlet. So we're about to go in there, take a look around, probably pick up a few things. Hi YouTube, Autumn Beckman here. Welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. My channel is all about luxury living on a budget from high-end luxury handbags and small goods to the everyday luxuries of life. If that sounds interesting to you, please make sure you subscribe, click the bell notification icon to be notified when I post new videos, and be sure to like the videos that you enjoy. And one of the perks of subscribing to my channel is you get to see my community post on your YouTube homepage where I post deals, discount codes, sales, and rare finds related to these beautiful things we love. Let's go inside. Okay, we are going in. Let's see what this place has for us. Trying not to get people's faces here. So here's just a quick overview. There's the front desk and lots of color. How wonderful. And shoes on the back wall. And this looks like men's stuff, hats, bags. And then we'll do some close-ups in a second. Staff door and more around here. Let's do some close-ups. Okay, so right when we come in the door, we've got some toaster bags and a few different colors here. Lovely, and then this rack. Now I have noticed that there's a lot of brown and there's a bunch of color in one section of the store and there's a little color mixed in to some of the others. So this was all of the backpacks, the drawstring, the regular laptop, you know, the tote backpack, the laptop back tap backpack, and then the roll top backpack. Over here we've got some of the travel pieces, especially the men's dop kits there. And these are their new briefcases. Let's take a peek at those. Okay, we've got magnets on the front here. And these are actually lined, so they're not that suede that we see in most of Portland Leather Good pieces. Here's the interior. We've got a big pocket for your laptop and some smaller pockets or yeah that's a smaller pocket on the front there that's nice i saw a couple of people walk out of the store before i came in with the other uh, like messenger laptop bag that has all the straps on it those were really nice looking this rack is fun we've got the lola bags that remind me of the mark jacobs tote and the market totes here I'm gonna try to get some of the pricing in there for you too so you can see that the bucket bags got not unicorn colors these are available on the website dream and mulberry and then these are the larger size so let's put two of these together so we can see there's the size difference between the large and the small bucket tote or bucket bag and there's the bases of those two because that really helps to see the difference in the size there's the luna bag and the eclipse bags there are lots of these like these smaller bags that i wish the straps were removable because they would be so great to just use as a pouch inside a larger bag here we have a table full of wallets these are the men's bifold like that the zip around wallets in the small size. I did a video on those. The large zip wallets, the bifolds, uh, card holders like that. These are the ranchers, the larger bifold wallets. And then let's take a look at these because I've been curious about those. This has a wristlet strap and then snap there. That's a pocket. You've got a zip here. And then this section with two card holders and this back section that could be great inside another bag or on its own and these straps are removable this one i'm not familiar with i've not seen this before so you have that strap that comes off that little thing have any of you seen these i don't remember seeing these on the website so that's a trifold that has card holders we've got one two three four five six another six over here a big pocket, two more there, a zipper, and another big pocket, and that's a big pocket. Wow, that holds a lot. 
that's pretty nice. Here are the leather jackets, beautiful colors. Love the green. There are the prices on the jackets. Those are the briefcases I was talking about. And then these are those over the shoulder little baguette type of bags. There we go. So that looks like that. I do wish you could put a longer strap on it. Some journals. Everything is in brown today. These are nice. I feel like this is called the penny bag. It's bigger than I thought it would be. Has a big front pocket and then the zipper, crossbody strap. That's nice. Laptop sleeves. Here we have some littles, mouse pads. And let me get like this and you can see what the prices are and it has the names of the items. No, it doesn't. Just kidding. But there you go, lots of brown today. Some bags. Here we have a bunch of brown tacos. Some little baby tacos. Here are the prices. They do have limits on a few items, but I haven't seen that limited very much. Some brown eclipse pouches. This one's pretty cool. Look at the texture on that. I'm not sure which leather that is, but I like that the wine totes and some tassels again we're pretty much looking at browns today some blacks a little yellow the keychains and the fiesta bags give you a better look at those that's what they look like these are the more structured leather bags those are nice couple of hats those makeup pouches and the eclipse pouches these are my favorites. I find them to be the most spacious and the easier to grab and go. And I'm really enjoying those. I have a bunch right now. Hats and bags hanging from things. The Luna bags are hanging up there. Is that what they're called? Am I imagining things or are those two different sizes? Here's some of their canvas totes. Did you know they do canvas totes as well? And the backpack in the back. And canvas duffels with leather trim. Great for travel. Here's a selection of totes that are not unicorns. The crossbody bags and the regular totes. And then we walk around and we see the color. I know this is what you guys have been waiting for. That's the unicorn you can ride. She has her own section in the store. Very cool. is table so you buy it as is for an extra discount things may be slightly scuffed or whatever this looks like a small crossbody mini crossbody in dune I'm guessing so that's pretty cool you don't see that color very often
And the last section of the store to see is these two racks. We have the butterfly bags over here. Again, these are all brown. Envelope things, crunch wraps, I think that's what people call them. I'll give you a better look. This one's in Storm, which is beautiful. I do regret sending back my Storm tote. I may have to buy another one. And the triangle bags. I love the triangle bags. They're beautiful. They also have these Metro crossbodies, which I'm interested in getting one of those when I find the right color, I think. It's got a magnet closure and a crossbody strap. And then these things. There's that bag, and then these are belt bags. But again, without the strap, great pouch inside of another bag. And that is the Portland Leather Goods Outlet. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll be able to bring you back here many more times uh, once we move up. Thank you so much for watching. I do appreciate it. Hope you enjoyed it. And I hope you have a fantastic day. Bye.